Nimble Streamer is a versatile tool not just for video streaming, but also for audio-only use cases. The most popular audio protocols for internet radio stations still are open source IceCast and Shoutcast. Both can be used as inputs for Nimble Streamer. In this video, we're going to show how to set up such an ingest and also transform it to other popular streaming protocols like HLS, Dash, RTMP, and SLDP. We have pre-configured IceCast 2 server for streaming some royalty-free music. We won't cover it in details in this video, as there are many other comprehensive tutorials about it. We see IceCast 2 daemon is up and running, MP3 files are used, and just minor changes to default playlists are made. We have used two playlist instances to demonstrate fallback. Here we run the fallback and main playlist instances with MP3 capable ICES utility. Both IceCast streams are up and running. We are switching to our cloud control panel to set up our ingest. Nimble Streamer has already been installed. Check our existing tutorials about that. Navigate to Live Stream Settings, Application tab, and click on Add Application Settings. Type in radio as an application name. Next, select the output protocols which will be available within this application. Click on HLS, MPEGTS for generating audio only HLS with TS chunks. We also checked RTMP, RTSP, DASH, SLDP, and IceCast to have IceCast output too. Check the Generate IceCast Metadata checkbox to have that meta in the stream and press the Save button. As the settings apply, all the incoming streams of the radio application will be transmuxed into these protocols. Now, click on the Live Poll Settings tab to specify incoming streams URLs. Click on Add IceCast URL button. Type in the primary and fallback URLs of our input source in the dedicated fields. Specify radio application for the incoming streams and name stream as one. Then add any description and click Save. Some time is needed to sync up settings. WMS panel shows if the source stream settings are synced by Nimble and identifies the currently active stream with check marks. To quickly jump to the list of incoming streams, click on a server's name on the breadcrumbs navigation line. Here we see a stream with the IceCast protocol as a source. To check output, click on the question mark at the end of the stream line. You will have a list of available URLs, which you can use in the Choose URL to Play drop down menu. There are also different players to choose for checking a stream for your convenience. SLDP, HLS, IceCast, and Dash. All the specified protocols we've defined for the radio application are available and are playing the IceCast source playlist. Now, we'll shut down the main playlist to demonstrate fallback switching. We stopped it, so there's only the fallback stream playing. We can see that only the MP3 fallback stream is available via iCast2 admin panel. Now, navigate to Live Poll Settings to check which stream is used by Nimble as source. Here, the checkmark moved to MP3 fallback source, but the stream is still available as Radio 1. It's up and running fine. Please note that if we run the mainstream again, it won't switch to mainstream until the fallback stream goes down. Here, it's still on a MP3 fallback in the WMS panel. Last but not least, the metadata. We will check its presence in the output stream by FF Probe. All the ICY tags are in the stream as expected. Please check this video description for all articles and videos related to the features described here.